So your position was that you, you do not you do not want to be bothered at all by any of these things that happen in the house. No, I want to live a very simple life. I but cooking want and sweeping and no, doing that, that, house that, that, that's not part. That's, I, that's I, simplicity, right? I did there. it. No, it is not. You see, it's a mindset. If it works for you, if you feel fulfilled by doing that, do it. You don't. No. No. Why? If the means exist for it to be done, why should I do it myself? Let me ask, will you walk to Kumasi? I'm not sure I will. Good. <laughs> but if you decide to walk, then it's a choice. Mm. It ought to be a choice. It ought not to be an imposition. Mm. Right? You didn't walk from your office here. Mm. Why? Why did, you, why did you drive in a car? <laughs> but years ago, you might not have afforded the car you, you drove. So you probably would have walked there or taken a, taken a taxi up to a certain way or, or taken a truck or, maybe, or probably walked. Mm. I want my decision to walk or ride or drive to be a choice, not an imposition. And my view is that if you are able to provide the means for a thing to be done, don't do it yourself. Spend your time on something else. And so why would I pick a broom or a brush to sweep unless I want to? Maybe I break a glass, I'll sweep it myself because I saw where the things went. And I can do it. I, a few times I've had to teach the people who work for me, like the cleaning. I will sit down in the toilet bowl and clean it in the way that will amaze you. I know how to clean a toilet bowl with a toothbrush. I know where to apply the parazone and everything, right? But I've taught you how to do it. Why would I do it myself? It's, it creates employment, so I won't do it.